Well, as a journalist, I've been trained to take an impassioned look, to take an objective look at how events unfold. But as a pastor, I've been trained to look at how it affects people, um, both on their, in their spirit and their physical needs. And so when the flooding occurred recently in the Red River Valley, I was really struck by how both of those came together because uh, I have friends and family. I grew up in the Red River Valley and knowing their stories, how it affected them, really affected me personally. But then as a journalist, I had to go and find out what was really happening. And it was really a pleasure to talk to our churches in the area and to the disaster relief coordinators in both Minnesota and North Dakota to find out how our church was responding and how our people were helping in this, uh, in this event. What really struck me the most, though, was how uh, there was a great sense of hope. When I contacted one pastor who was sandbagging at the Fargo Dome, making millions of sandbags with everyone else. He said there's sort of a party atmosphere, not because we don't see the danger ahead of us, but because we have hope that we're coming together to really help. And as I spoke with various people through the region to build a story and to tell that story, I was really uh, overwhelmed by the sense of how many people from far and wide had come together to uh, bring assistance to this place that I call home. When I heard local towns, Valley City opened their doors to people coming from Fargo and Moorhead. When I heard of flooding in Hankinson and Wapiton, I was really affected because these are places where friends and family still live. So when I think about One Great Hour of Sharing, when I think about the Emergency USA Fund, I think of how it's something that provides immediate needs, provides help and assistance to those people who are in a dire straits and without it would really be hopeless. And so that hope was something that I really uh, cherish that our church can provide that our funds and our assistance provide every day.